Psalm 18, 35 and 36. Thou hast also given me the shield of thy salvation and thy right hand hath holden me up and thy gentleness hath made me great. Thou hast enlarged my steps under me that my feet did not slip. What jumps out to me the most in this portion of scripture, he given a shield, he's given strength with his right hand, he's done so much, but it's his gentleness that has made him great. His gentleness that it, the psalmist refers to that he appreciates the most. Um, a lot of times when we're trying to motivate people, we do it by putting pressure on people. Parents put pressure on their children to perform academically, to achieve high test scores, to get good grades. Anything less uh, is not going to be acceptable. You'll be a failure. Otherwise, employees put pressure on employees to meet quotas. And a lot of times when those quotas are met, they'll go unrewarded. But to fail to meet those will be met with swift punishment. There's always pressure, always pressure to perform, always pressure to excel, always pressure to be the best, to be on top. And uh, there's if we fail, there, there's no recourse. There's no way to get back up. But his gentleness, his extreme patience with us has allowed us the wiggle room, the room to grow into into something great. It's allowed us to become everything that he desires for us to be. He's he's made a the steps wide enough that if we do fall down, we have room to get back up. Your patience, your extreme gentleness is what's going to allow us to become great.